Hey guys, Cindy Imani here and welcome back to my channel. Today in my video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I removed my mink eyelashes. So to remove them, you're going to need um, some olive oil. This is some olive oil that I picked up from my local grocery store. If not olive oil, you can also use coconut oil. You're going to need some cotton pads, some Q-tips, and one of the little spoolie things um, that you get when um, getting the eyelashes um, installed. If not, you can use a little spoolie on the back of your eyebrow pencil. And once I'm done removing my eyelashes to moisturize my lashes and promote growth, I use some organic castor oil. So if you want to see how I remove my mink eyelashes, I'm going to first need you to like this video and subscribe below and keep watching. So first I'm starting with this Stop and Shop olive oil. I know some people also use coconut oil to take off their lashes, but I only had olive oil in the house, so olive oil is what I'm using. And I'm taking the Q-tip and I'm saturating the Q-tip in the olive oil. Then I am going to just basically drench the extensions in my eyelashes in the olive oil. So just basically try to apply as much oil as you can. As you can see, I don't have makeup on and I wear contacts and I don't have my contacts on just so oil doesn't get on my um, contact lenses. Doing like a um, putting on mascara um, motion with the q-tip and oil next i'm using the little spoolie that i got when i got my mink eyelashes applied and i'm using it just to brush the oil through my lashes and as you can see there is some of the mink lashes coming off already and i'm being super gentle so now that the olive oil is on my lashes and i brushed it through with the little spoolie i'm just going to let it sit about five to ten minutes this is the most important part so the olive oil can like have its time to like work on the glue bond so i'm just going to set a timer on my phone so i'm setting it for 10 minutes so now that the 10 minutes are up i'm using the cotton pads to saturate my lids more with the olive oil so i'm just taking it and just pressing the top of my lashes with the cotton pads the key to this whole process is just <laughs> using as much oil as you possibly can to break the bond between your natural lash and the um, mink um, eyelash extensions now i'm using another fresh pad and i put olive oil on it once again and now I'm going to actually start working on removing the lashes. So with the pad pressing down and I'm just using diagonal motions. So, so as you can see, even with that little press that came off. So diagonal and towards my nose and towards my outer face. And you're not pulling, you're padding towards that outer direction and if you can feel like a lash is gently coming off of course pull it but don't like grab it and don't yank if you have to yank it's not ready to come off and when you're doing this just remember this is not a quick process it's going to take 30 to 40 minutes to remove the lashes depending on how many you had left on um, so if you try to rush it's a high chance that you may, um, you know, remove um, some unwanted natural lashes and, you know, damage your, your eyelashes or potentially damage like your eye because you are patting and rubbing. So just take your time and kind of let the lashes fall off on its own. So now that I have all the lashes off, I'm going to... Go into the castor oil like I did for the other eye off camera. So now I'm just placing the castor oil on my lash line to moisturize my lash and promote growth. That's how I remove my mink lashes. If you like this video and you found it helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.